I already did this type of intro where I sing the song. Welcome everybody to sit back gaming. Uh, 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 uh. Well, <laughs> in the last episode, I'm still, I'm still pissed off that we haven't told anyone about Monchan. But you know, hey, it's anime. <laughs> It works. So, let's get to it. I see you didn't want her out. You didn't want to out her. <laughs> didn't want to out her on Twitter, didn't you? It's up to her what to do now. You just wanted to find out the truth, and now you do. Well, I guess that's just how you roll. Oh, I Hanukkah has been added to the fanatize mode. Fanatize mode? Hmm. So much for good luck will come your way. So it was just a bunch of hooligans abusing animals for fun, huh? That's just sickening. So the so-called white wolf was just a poor abused dog. Anyhow, I didn't expect you to actually find out the truth. Way to go, new kid. I know you definitely got what it takes to be an ORC member. You should seriously consider joining us. Officially? Here's the bag. Here's the bag that says you're officially joined. Uh, I need the water. Uh, I know you- oh good. You don't have to give us your answer right away, okay? We can wait, but if you do have it right away- Oh, right! Press! How's it going on Quacker? Wakaba spins her pan and points it at Nami. White wolf actually poor panically pooch. How's that? Roger that! For details, visit the Occult Research Club. <clears throat> Nanami types on her phone with skillful finesse. Oh, cracker. And posted. Thanks. Thanks. Oh, Nanami, looks like someone got hurt near the stairs. Makaba turns her tablet towards Nanami. Hmm, a male student got injured on the stairs near the roof? Roof? It might be the curse of the Mikato. Here we go again. Nanami trots out the club room. You gotta admire that girl's spunk, right? Well, that's all fine and dandy, I guess. Does she always get like that about the curse of the Mikoto? All oh, right, I forgot. You just transferred in, so of course you wouldn't know. Wakaba gives an ambiguous, ambigu ambiguous smile as she looks out the window, her gaze giving way to somber wis wistfulness. The curse of Mikoto is, let's say, special to Nanami. But not at the moment later, Wakaba back to her usual old smile. You know, I seriously didn't think you'll help out with the investigation. When you asked if anyone in class A suddenly got better grades, the first person to come to mind was Honoka. Good thing you kept the whole Honoka thing a secret from Nanami. Nanami's kind of reckless, so I worry about her from time to time. You must be good friends. I like that. Well, we've been together since our first year. I just can't leave her alone. Well, feel free to pay us a visit again if you'll feel uh, feel like it. Do I get to go back to my room? Huh? The stairs! I miss you! When I leave the club room and head for the stairs, I see Nanami walking back this way. Heading home, I see? Oh, the cracker tip? I couldn't get any proof, but it's gotta be the curse of Mikoto. Well, I gotta head back to the club room. Gotta go report or I'll get yelled at again. Nanami st starts walking away, but a few steps later, she turns around. Kiri, you were a big help. Thanks for everything. See you tomorrow. And with a jubilant smile, she trots off with a twinkle in her step. What I say, you ended up having to use your power. Was it a fluke? Hee hee hee. Well, I wonder. I say, I say you let your curiosity get the better of you. Ugh, curiosity. I'm my own worst enemy sometimes. When faced with the myster mysterious or the unknown, it just I just can't help but want to know the truth. It got me into more trouble than I care to mention. You're curious as why she resorted to animal sadism, aren't you? There's no use hiding it from you. Machan is right. The stuff with Hanukkah in the forest, there was nothing remotely normal about that. Why did I get the feeling uncovering the truth will not end well? You're saying there's a point of no return if you d del d delve deep, delve into deep, huh? Well, I guess you're right about that. 
Eccentric, weirdo, weirdo, space case, psychic? What else did they did they call you? I glare at Monchan as she lists names people called me in the past. I don't want to let it get to me. Sticks and stones and all that. What? Don't don't want to remember? My bad, my bad. Anyway, here's what my intuition tells me. You'll be fine as long as you got that nutcase Nanami around. You look relatively normal in comparison. Hee hee hee. What? That doesn't make it any better? Well, you do you, do you Kiri. Man, this is getting, this is getting fun. Yay. Oh, I didn't read that. <laughs> June 8th. Huh? Have you gotten used to campus yet? Miss Mizuki calls me out after home after homeroom. She often checks on me since I'm new here. Monchan thinks she's a good teacher. Sorry for the wait, Kiri. Let's go. Nami peeks in from the door. She has been she's been visiting the class next door to return a book. <laughs> Tihi, looks like you made friends with Kagura-san. <laughs> Mizuki Sensei just fades away across to the right, never to be seen again. <laughs> Mizuki Sensei leaves the classroom with a smile as Nanami trots over this way. Oh, sorry, did you need uh, Kyorin for something? Kyo Kyorin? Kyorin? Ah, oh, I still don't know. No, not really, I shake my head. Nanami picks up her bag. Alright, then let's roll out. But first, where should we go? Oh, yeah, we haven't decided that yet. <laughs> Toya Matic? He's running today, right? Let's go, let's go! Gotta go fast, we wanna get up close. Girls start running through the halls, their voice shrieking in excitement. They must be heading to the field to see track and field crashes. Ah, let's head there too! Where there's a crowd, there's rumors to be heard. Let's go, time for a campus tour. Wow, a campus tour again! The fields used to uh, the fields used for gym class. It's a bit far from the main building, so don't be slow when changing. It's also used for extracurricular activities like soccer, baseball, and track and field. The athlete the athletics club at Fujisawa Academy is especially good. Quite a few specu uh, spectating students are seated in the benches by the field and even the courtyard. Those girls must be here to see the track and field ace. Ace? Oh yeah, what's his name? Toyama, Toyama kun the third year. He breaks records every tournament. It's like a uh, broken record. He's super popular with the girls. And wait, haven't you met him before? She may be a seven mystery nerd, but I guess she knows who you, who's who around the campus too. But where's Toyama kun The coach starts practice, but Toriyama seems to be a no show. The crowd starts stirring. Oh no, oh no! Is that a guy? <laughs> Toriyama kun's not running today. He's been in the stump lately, so maybe he's taking a break. Honor student, honor scholars get breaks, huh? Geez, do you know how hard we work to get these seats? Quit whining, honor students. Are on a completely different level compared to us. Aw, if only I had that sort of privilege. Then why don't you just become an honor scholar? Nope, not happening. Yeah, of course not. Anyways, have you heard the rumors? Apparently, you can become an honor scholar at the Library of Wisdom. Oh shit, we just turned. The Library of Wisdom? Hey, mind spilling some deets on that rumor? The boy twitches at the sudden call out as the girls he was talking to takes a step back. Uh, sure. All I heard was at the Library of Wisdom, somewhere at the Academy grants you the wisdom of an honor scholar. It's just a rumor. Alright, information acquired on the Library of Wisdom. Pa 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 pow! That settles it. Hey, come on! Oh, come with me for a sec. Huh? Again? I'm getting a bad feeling about this. Nanami keeps nudging me from behind. Come on, come on. So, why are we in the occult research club room again? That's what I like to know. <laughs> she teleported us here. The campus tour. Yeah, yeah. Of course, we're gonna do that. Just hold your horses. Nanami stares at her phone, muttering to herself. Mutter, mutter, mutter. What's she doing? 
I'm just doing some research. I want to know more about the Library of Wisdom, but nothing's coming up. Oh, wow, the whole Toriyama thing's blowing up on Quacker. I don't mind you researching the Library of Wisdom, but do you have any leads? Na Nanami explains what's happening at the field. I see, but that's not quite the Scholar of Wisdom I've heard about. That What's this Scholar thing about? I thought it might be a new lead. How about we investigate the Honor Scholar system? Honor Scholar, huh? Okay, sure. Easiest way to go and ask an, an, an honor scholar. Know any? Scholar, sc scholar, school, eh. Tomiyan kun, an honor scholar, right? Think he'll tell us anything? Oh, my throat. Ugh. Toriyama, huh? Yeah, not happening. He's so. Oh. Aw, oh, too bad. Honor scholars, huh? Who else? I don't know anyone that famous. Ah, oh, I know! <laughs> Liverpool. Ah, oh, there's one guy who would be perfect. You know him? Nanami, the stick in the mud. Oh, the student council president? So Kujukun's an honor student scholar, huh? I had no idea! Hehehe! <laughs> stick in the mud, huh? Guess even the student council president's got it rough. Kujo-kun, huh? Yeah, I'm sure he'll know something. Let's go to Stukko office. Hold on! I doubt he's been, he, he'd be there right now. He's probably out patrolling campus. I bet you haven't finished that toy. Go look for Kujo while you show the new kid around campus, know what I mean? Whoops. You're right. Haha. <laughs> Thanks for the right reminder, Prez. Wait! liver -kun! No! He keeps... I don't want to leave him! She's completely forgot, huh? Oh god. Oh, Nanami looks this way with a twinkle in her eye. I gotta like take a minute. Oh my bro, my my throat. So will you help me look for Kujakun, please? I'm starting to see a pattern here. Well, it's not like you'll refuse her. If anyone can say no to Nanami, I like to meet them someday. She keeps asking me for favors, but it's hard to say no and she's just so damn friendly. And nice at all, at all the time, at all the time. <laughs> Thanks. Here's a candy as a reward. <laughs> it's a sour patch. First it's sour, then it's sweet. The candy packaging has an alien on it. Encounters of the third candy mystery flavor. It's a new item at the corner store. I just had to know what flavor it was, so I bought it. Oh, what's that? Sounds. Oh, what's that? Sounds fun. Give me one too, Nanami. Okie dokie. Thank you. Gracias. I guess if anyone, if anyone's gonna buy it, it's be the Occult Research Club. Time to find the Stuco president. Let's go. Good grief. The campus tour has been completely sidelined. Oh, we're here. Quack. Wonder if Kujo Kun's around. Ah, uh, guess not. Too bad. It doesn't look like Kujo's in the cafeteria. Oh, what? Want something to eat, Nami chan? Oh, Auntie. Ugh. It. Mm. It always smells so yummy, but I'm sorry, I can't right now. By the way, Auntie, have you seen Kujo Kun lately? Kujo Kun? Oh, the Stuko president. Oh, he was talking with the Stuko member here just a little bit ago. He's such a polite kid. Oh, should I say gentleman? I hope you get a boyfriend just like him, Nanami. If only I were a bit younger. I'd like a piece of that, if you know what I mean. <laughs> oh god! <laughs> <laughs> ah! We got a cougar here. This old lady just doesn't know when to stop talking, does she? Oh, hold on, Andy. Did Kujo mention where he was going? Uh, oh, right. He said he would have some places at pa to patrol, but he didn't say where he was heading. Sorry, I can't be more of help. No, it's okay. Thanks, Auntie. Looks like Kujo is still making the rounds. I wonder where he. Uh, I wonder where he went. Guess he he won't be easy to track down. A few students are spread about, but none of them seem to be Kujo. Are you Kujo? Are you Kujo? No dice. 
Guess Kujo Kun's not here. Hey you, seen Kujo Kun around? Kujo, a uh, Kujo, the Stu Co president? Nope, haven't seen him. Haven't, haven't seen him, huh? Oh, have you heard any rumors about honor school scholars? Rumors about honor students? Like anything? Yeah, anything at all. Well, all I know is that it's hard to become one, and they're given perpetual, pre preferial, perpetual. Oh God, talking, thinking, words, hurts. Ah, preferential treatment at the academy. Oh right, and I heard about my friend at the library committee that honor scholars use the library a lot. Oh okay. Though it kind of makes sense that geniuses use the library. That helps any. Yeah, thanks. You're a big help. Not exactly earth-shattering info. Are we in the library? We're on the roof? Hmm. It feels great to up here on the roof. High open spaces are pretty nice. Nanami K uh, Kagura spreads her arms out with a smile. The clear sky spreads out wide above the roof. I love it up here. It's refreshing, empty, after hours. Now, uh, it's re oh, it's, I love it up here. It's refreshingly empty after hours. Now, where's Kujo Kun? Nanami Kagura frees in the middle of her speech. <sighs> Nanami's eyes fall upon Yukino, who's looking off into the distance with her hand on the fence. Hey, I don't see Kujo here, so how about we leave before she notices us? Nanami turns her back on Yukino and whispers, when suddenly, I can hear you. Well, <sighs> with Yukino in the picture, I think we're going to stop here and we'll continue on in the next episode and see what Yukino has to offer. Thank you everybody for watching and have a great day.